What's up, what's up, guys? It's your boy Juarmo. In today's video, guys, Vera and Paulin. So, welcome back, guys. In today's video, uh, I want to showcase Vera as a support. She is one of the bottom uh, tier list supports, but guys, with Paulin, she might become one of the better supports. Why am I saying this? Well, Obviously, Sphera has a passive. Don't mind this one, guys. It's just a patch bug. But whenever an ally is under stealth status, restore this ally's HP and Vera's HP by 6% of the max HP. So it means when an ally gets stealth, Vera and the ally are healed. This synchronizes with her basic attack attacks and the um, ally with the lowest uh, HP gets stealth. So basically, he gets stealth, he will heal, and Vera will heal. Her ultimate crit rate buff, really nice crit rate buff for two turns. And inflicts stealth on the enemy on all enemy uh, allies sorry on, on all allies so it means c buffs or uh, team with crit rate up gives everybody invisible everybody gets healed including vera so why is she good right now well guys with paulin obtainable for literally almost everybody if you have one or two awakening five heroes you can already get this guy his ultimate increase the allies cap hp by 50 percent for two turns restore so it increases the cap it heals and it gives all allies besides paul and himself stealth for two turns which means when he gets his ultimate he raises the cap of the allies he heals he gives everybody stealth which means vera's passive will proc there and she will also heal everybody with her passive how does this work i'm going to show you guys right now just a fast faction abyss do floor 13 this one okay let's pop it out let's see boom so only paulin used the skill right then vera turned let's go let's see see vera did some nice healing just with her passive by doing nothing literally with paulin i'm gonna do it again now we're gonna do this skill and now we're gonna use vera's invisible invis uh, stealth skill as well boom let's see now there we go even better numbers so that's actually not bad especially when you combine those together so he has a defense buff he has a tenacity uh, buff heal max hp cap she gets a crit buff she get the healing done wim has the shielding so I'm running this team actually with Bari right now into the campaign mode. I'm three-starring everything right now until Hell 8. Uh, I am stuck at the final boss, but it doesn't matter that much. I'm just going to roll the entire battle so you guys can see how much Vera will actually heal the team. Oh yeah, also a fun fact. Ariel, when she inflicts a kill, she gets stealth as well. So when Ariel inflicts a kill, she will heal herself. And she will heal Vera as well with it. So that's also a really nice win-win situation. Obviously, same with Lucifer. Is If Lucifer gets a kill, he gets stealth. So he will heal himself and Vera. So that's also a pretty nice combo. But considering now with Paulin and people that obtained Santa in the past, Dragon Tribe is probably the, the, the easiest uh, faction abyss clearing it. So you can see here she gave Ariel stealth when she boom stealth everybody stealth for Paulin as well because of her basic attack because she was the lowest HP. We're just running this one, guys. Boom! Everybody stealth. There we go. Look at the healing numbers. Look at the healing numbers. It's 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 insane, guys. Spe I'm not sure if she will work for late game players, guys. To be honest, but for early game players that have a Vera that got Paulin, you definitely can use her early game. You definitely can use her early game. So with that said, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did so, give me a thumb up. If you have Vera and Paulin, well, there's gonna be easy clear Helling three. So I'm gonna show you guys here, so you can see. These sacred lands just restarted with just this team. 
this is the team that i'm currently using i wanted to use ariel for a full five man but i think uh, barry has a decent amount of aoe and he will help me later so like i said guys thank you for watching if you enjoyed the video give me a thumb up hit the subscribe button it means a lot to me and see you guys in the next one